What's up, YouTube? Alex here, Inch 95's channel, bringing you guys another crazy card review. I think this card review is like number six. Uh, just holding this camera here just because I want I want this Yu-Gi-Oh symbol the on my mat to be the the picture on the on the picture you guys will see. Anyway, now I guess I can move it. But uh, just a quick thing. Uh, just got out on summer today. Got perfect scores. Finals. I I got perfect scores on two of them. Did amazing with school, so school's over for me. Videos every day, most likely. Uh, dueling, aim, Skype, everything. I'm going to have all that information if you guys want to hit me up down here in the underbar so you can check it out. Uh, I'm probably going to make an MSN or something like that. I used to have one, but I don't remember any other passwords for it. Uh, aside from that, uh, I'm, watch I I'm a big basketball fan. It's probably like that, soccer, and football are my three favorite sports. Uh, probably soccer, obviously, is my favorite. And then basketball, I'm watching the playoffs right now. So I want to, uh, right now, it's the Celtics versus the Celtics versus Magic. They just started. It is just 3-0 for Boston right now. So uh, Boston's getting wet really, really early for no reason. But uh, I could care less who won. Actually, I, I don't really like the Magic just because uh, I'm a huge Lakers fan, and I didn't like the fact that they made it to the finals last year. But, yeah, I, I know you guys can argue, but put you what team you guys want to win below here. I want to hear you guys' opinions, what you guys will think will turn out in the playoffs. Seriously, criticize, whatever. But anyway, I, I'm a Lakers fan, so it's whatever. I'm not bandwagoning. I've always liked the Lakers. Anyway, just a quick, another, one other quick side note. I hate Black Wings, but um, I pulled these in some packs that I got, and I just want to get rid of them, and nobody wants them. I don't know why. So if any guys want a Black Wing Breeze, the Zephyr First Dead Ultra Rare, uh, they're fresh out of the pack, and a Ghost Rare Black Wing Dragon again, First Edition. Hopefully you guys can see those. I just pulled them and I don't want them. They're fresh, like out of the pack. I ha I've barely, I didn't even touch them really. Like I just slid them from the pack into here. So if any of you guys want those, uh, hit me up. Just you know, just offer for them. Preferably cash, but whatever. Anyway, uh, whoa, Howard just got his first block. That is so busted. Up, 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 Jermaine. Oh, that's not Jermaine Nelson. Aw, oh, no three. <laughs> anyway, hopefully I don't get like hit up for this by YouTube. But anyway, this is a card review, so I'm just gonna hop straight into it. First card. Uh, Mind Crush, I think this card, a lot of people said it wasn't going to be good. I think this format, it's really good, mainly against, like, Infernities and stuff. Uh, Black Wings are pretty much dead right now, but in your meta, they might not be. I think there are still a few variants. I may post one up soon. That I think it's probably the most successful Black Wing variant, and it does involve Breeze and stuff. Those are the best versions, in my opinions. But anyway, I don't want to talk about that. Uh, this hurts Infernities so much because they, when they add a Launcher, and an Archfiend, or a Barrier, you can just chain this or whatever, like End Phase, or when they add it to their hand, uh, and just get rid of it. So it's really, really effective. Plus, you get to see the rest of their hand, so it's like another trap dash you. So, or you can do a last-minute resort play. Like, if you know they have the OTK, you can just call a Launcher or whatever. Uh, if you're pretty sure that they have the OTK off on you, if they start setting a bunch of stuff, ask them to set one by one. Uh, by the way, another quick note on Infernities, another thing that a lot of Infernity players are starting to cheat now, like actual cheating, is instead of, if they can't get their OTK off, they'll set some of their monsters in their spell and trap zones. So if you guys are going to tournaments and stuff, ask before anyone scoops up their cards to um, have a judge or someone verify that all the back rows are actual spells and traps and are able to be set. Because I have, someone tried to cheat me like that and a couple of my friends did and a lot of events have been having that now. But anyway, Mind Crush is really good. I think it's a really good side deck card. Especially at this time. Next card, uh, I've been hearing a lot of commentary about it. And I want somebody to try it out and tell me how it is. I may try it out soon, but I'm, I'm kinda, I was kind of busy lately. Uh, Shadow Imprisoning Mirror. This kills pretty much every dark deck. I think uh, successful Lightsworn decks could probably run this. If not even main, because this card is just so good. I mean, uh, it shuts down so much stuff. Plague Spreader, Sangans. Uh, it shuts down the majority of Infernities, like Archfiends and all that crazy stuff when they hit the field or Grave. Necromancer, uh, Avenger, it's just so good, like, I don't, I wouldn't, but the only thing is, there's a lot of backer removal, so I wanna see if any of you guys can make one, you guys will get a shout out, and I'll feature your video on my channel, like, I will literally put the deck up on my channel, if you want, I can make it, or I can just, you can send me your video, and I'll put it up on my channel, and say, you, it'll be you, make a deck with this, uh, a type of maybe anti-meta deck, or some innovative deck with this, in like one to two Starlight Roads with like maybe like one to two Dust Tornadoes. I want to see a fun deck or a good competitive deck like that. Maybe anti-meta based. But I want to see a deck with this. So that's another challenge I have for you guys. So what, I think it's really good. It can shut down so much stuff. And uh, the only reason I'm reviewing it is because of that. Because it hurts a lot of the meta right now. 
The only thing it really doesn't hurt is GB's, um, Machina to an extent. Doom Caliber's, Doom Caliber Knight is pretty much dead and extinct, so, but if they do run it, I guess this hurts them a lot. Uh, I think it's still really good. Uh, so yeah, it's pretty much it. That's my card review. I couldn't think of much to say because I'm into the basketball game right now, and I had this planned out for a while. I was going to do this yesterday, but I had a performance, or not performance, a uh, speech and stuff to do today, so it's whatever. But yeah, it's my card review, Shadow Imprisoning Mirror, Mind Crush. Try these out. Again, try to make a deck with uh, Shadow Imprisoning Mirrors mained. I want to see a main by somebody. I'll feature your deck on my channel. If not sided, I want to see a cool deck. Maybe somebody can get their deck featured, get some extra subscribers. So uh, yeah, that's pretty much it on the card review. Again, if you guys want a Blackwing Breeze or Blackwing Wing Dragon, First Dead, Ghost Rare, Ultra Rare, hit me up because I don't want them. Like, I really do not like these. I, I hate Blackwings, so I don't... Uh, I've never made it, like... I would never make a Blackwing deck anymore, like, unless it was just to sell it. So, uh, yeah, if you guys want those, hit me up. Also, by the way, if you guys have any Thunder Kings, I want them. I know they're getting reprinted in Gold Series 3. Like, I know the list and everything, but, um, as far as Gold Series 3, I, I don't value them that high, but I do need Thunder Kings right now, like, almost desperately at the moment. So if you guys want to trade or anything, just hit me up. Uh, so, yeah, Alex here, Inch95's channel. Peace, you guys. This has been a card review number 6. So, uh, yeah, both of those guys, and, uh, yeah. Uh, be sure to subscribe, rate, and comment. You know, subscribe button up there, rate, and comment. Uh, tell me who you guys want in the playoffs, basketball reviews currently. So, uh, yeah, uh, Soccer Cup's coming up soon, July, or June, sorry, June 11th. Later.